Hi there, this is Miss Leahy and this is part two. This is showing you how to set your first scene, which is going to be your title screen for your video. Notice over to the left, there's a, a series of tools. I'm going to click on T for text and I'm going to ignore all these labels and things like that. I'm just going to click here, add your text, keeping it simple. In your text box, you're going to type in the name of your country or something clever about the name of your country and then your name. Don't forget, we're not putting last names, just last initials. When you're finished typing, you can highlight what you've typed. You can come over here to all these tools that are over under the tool, the, I mean, excuse me, the text tool. I'm going to choose this. And then I'm going to make it a little bit smaller like that. But then I want to make the font size smaller. And the easiest way to make all of the font size smaller is just to grab a corner. Now, when I grab that corner, I'm realizing that I really would like the Czech Republic words to be a little bit bigger. So I'm highlighting just the Czech Republic. And then I can come over here to the tool that is the font size tool. And I'm, I'm going to make that 200. And that looks better, but now I need to pull this apart. There you go. Great. So now I want to make it a different color. And that is down here in the fill. So I click on fill. I could choose one of these colors or I could go to more colors and pick that. That sound, sounds good. I click away and I like what I see, but I am going to bring that over. Notice that I can move the whole text box by moving my mouse so that it is a four-headed arrow. Oopsie. I got it. There it is. And then I drag the whole thing. And there's a line that will help me keep it centered. The next thing I'm going to do, besides a text box on this um, first scene, is I'm going to grab a picture and put the picture in. I happen to already have searched for a picture. I like this and I don't even need to download it. I can just copy it. But I do remember that I have to give credit. I have to cite my source, which is Travel Pulse Canada. I'm right clicking. That's a two finger snake bite click on your Chromebook. And then I choose copy image. And then I come back to my, um, my project and I right click and I choose paste. And now I can click in the middle of that picture and drag it. And again, just like the text box, I can grab a corner and resize the whole picture. You may not want to grab it on a side because that resizes it, but it also cuts it. So I highly recommend that when you are resizing, you grab a corner. Don't forget that you need to make a text box for citing this work. So I'm going to go back, make sure I'm in my text tool. And if I'm not, I click here. Then I click my, add my text. And then I'm going to type in image from, and then that image was from Travel Pulse Canada. So I type in travel. Oopsie, forgot to click. There you go. Travel. And now I'm going to resize that. So I grab a corner, make it really small. I have to still be able to read it, but I don't want it so noticeable that everybody's looking at my credits instead of my actual work. And I could turn this at a 90 degrees and then move this picture over a little bit and then put the image right over here. I mean, the uh, credits right over there. Now, my last thing that I could do on this first scene is I could change the background color. So to do that, I'm clicking on background color and I'm choosing a color that's recommended or I'm clicking on more colors or I could even click this um, ink uh, dropper and then I can pull a color out if I like that. Great. If I don't, I choose another color. I can close that tool back up. And that is my first slide. And I like that a lot. Thanks for listening. Stay tuned for the second slide or the second scene.